This module shows how to diagnose and clear an obstructed drain hose. Symptoms include a pressure drop in the home, salty service water, or slow to no drain flow during a regeneration. On our FLEC 5800 valve, it is located on the side. We can check the hose to see if there are any obstructions in it. We can remove this assembly by pulling the clip loose from the body and pulling the fitting forward. This fitting unthreads from the barbed fitting. This fitting is rated for 1.5 gallons. If necessary, we will clean this opening with a soft brush or warm water to ensure we are getting the correct flow to drain. Others may be brass and again will be stamped for what the flow is. Please make sure to match the one that your system is designed for. We can then move over to our barbed fitting and the remainder of the hose. We can blow through this to make sure that there is a clean flow out to the drain. If we do not get full flow through, we would then want to replace any components that are not able to be cleaned with warm water. When we are reassembling, we want to make sure that all the connections are airtight by using plumber's tape on any threaded connections. This unit uses an O-ring in order to seal it to the body, so we would want to make sure that it is lubricated as necessary in order to seal it to the body. Pressing the seal back in, we can clip it in and test our progress by running a regeneration. There are drain systems that are attached to all valves. Your system may also have a drain line attached to the brine tank. To make sure that you can troubleshoot properly and make sure that one does not cause issues to the other, T-fitting should not be used. Make sure there are independent runs to the drain for both units. Thanks for watching.